guys welcome to the house of ginger today we are going to finish the other mossy shoe that we decorated you don't need to decorate the bottom so no big deal but the beautiful fairy mossy shoe i think it's lovely and i left the moss somewhere now i have to find the moss where did i stick the moss okay found the moss so we're going to create another shoe so we have a similar set, maybe not so much matchy-matchy. Now I have to move everything and go get the moss. As you think you're prepared, you are not prepared. So, that's okay. Now, moss is messy. <laughs> so prepare for mess with the moss. All right, so I got the sheet. Makes life easier. Hobby Lobby, good times. It only cost, I think this cost $6. And since it's flat, it lays out beautifully and glues out beautifully. So you need three glue sticks safely per shoe. I trimmed have the scissors off the access but I didn't need and as tempting as it is to get prettier shoes remember you are covering it up so don't get pretty shoes get not so pretty shoes all right now starting with the moss again I'm going to just cut this giant square because that's what I used last time. And that way I can get this part out of the way. There we go. Alright. Not so bad. Now down. Again, the goal is not to make it completely identifiable, identical, identifiable. It's a shoe. We can identify that. Um, back to the point. The goal is, it doesn't have to be a twinsy. doesn't hurt if that's what you want. Not my overly objective objective. But I do want to decorate the interior first so I will glue down haphazardly doesn't have to be fancy with the glue there we go Ooh. and that's always a challenge and you got to take off so the back is not sticky but it all sticks to the grid. So that's kind of helpful. Alright, so you're going to just shove it up in there so that it's all the way back to the wall. And then push it on down. And in. Alright. Tamp that down. Make sure it's where you want it to be. And voila. Now if you want to cut this part so you can fold it over perfectly fine don't want to fold it over perfectly fine these are going on my bookshelf <gasps> perfectly fine so like i said there's that so again salvation army it was a half off day don't get the really pretty shoes there's no point. You are covering this up. There's a little bit of bejewelment. That was a treat. All right. Now, on the other shoe, I put this in the background. Again, depending on how much of this is going to show. Hmm. What to do, what to do. 
All right, we'll put a little bit on the back. Oh, there's no backing, so we're good. Look at that problem solved. All right. Do my bidding. Ah, bang for buck. Where am I going with this? Here we go. All right. Press and fold. Squish. All right. Get the glue, glue strings out of the way. All right. Now, like I said, I just worked with the moss first just made sense we'll get some across the back here if you want to be all measure meticulous you just kind of measure it out Ooh, I think I ran into a stump a little tree stump Nothing like the art of glue. Love me some glue. Where would we be without hot glue? I would hate to think. I really would, because Lord knows, a lot of us love it and utilize it a lot. All right, so there's that. All right, so here we've got a little overlap. Cut that off. Need more glue. Focus on one part, don't overthink it. All right. Lay it down. Let's get it down. We're going to make it pretty later. Just get it down. All right. Now, because in order to make things lay flat, you're going to need to trim. So again, glue trim, stick it down. Glue trim, stick it down. Oh, here we go. And stick it down. Just stick it all down. I don't use a hot, hot glue gun. I don't like to burn myself. But you gotta use what you gotta use. So don't go overboard. Just use what you got. Alright, stick another spit down there so we can get that to lay down. Alright, get that down. Yes, glue strings everywhere. Torture. Glue strings are everywhere. All right, let's get this part. Right, get that out of the way. And lay this puppy down here. Good to go. And again, I'm I'm, I'm mossy. All right, there's that. Glue strings happen. That should be a shirt. Any ideas there? Glue strings happen. All right. Now, what we did on this one, okay, so obviously I covered the back a little bit more, so I don't have as much, so we could go with this piece. I got this originally because I also got these pretty blue pumpkins from the dollar store so again you could make this fall esque you can make this not so fall this is good for all seasons as I say 
All right, so I'm just gonna stick that in the back there. Glue happens. Oh, look at that, I'm already in need of, I was working on a half a glue stick. So there we go. Now we're on to glue stick number two. Woo, get, get down. All right, again, you know you can clean up your glue string, so don't stress about that. And if you need something to help you press down because of the heat. Oh, mercy. That's a big string. All right. Good times. Good to go. All right. Now, this doesn't have to take long. And don't burn yourself. Even low heat guns can be warm. There we go. So yeah, because I did one ahead of time because I know time is of the essence sometimes in crafting. You have a certain amount of time or you have too much time or not enough time. You never know. All right, so let us go forth again. Just trim away. Trim, 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 trim. All right. Now, the last time I laid those down, I did them like here. But I don't know. I don't know where I want them this time. So I'm going to continue wrapping with some moss up the back. Get her down. Get that. There we go. See, you can totally work with a shoe because you can manipulate it. Fold it however you want to fold it down works with you. All right. Look at us go. Click of the wink. All right. Now. All right, we got some more. So see, I had glued these suckers together from a previous little craft of just displaying things. So not think about it too much. Let's shove this down here. Make it work. Make it work for you, not against you. All right, we got this big old piece. I don't want it, but we've got a glue string. All right, let's tack that down there. So we're good to go. Glue strings you can mess with later. Don't stress about the glue strings. They're everywhere. They're not going away. All right, let us cut off this leaf so we can tack it down here in the back. Right, see, even though I've got this like extra layer here, it's not a flaw. It works with me, not against me. It's a craft, it's not an art project. Nobody's judging this. This is for enjoyment, enjoyment, and creating something fun for yourself. That's DIY. Because, you know, tchotchkes cost a lot these days. Who needs tchotchkes? Well, we all like a good tchotchke. That's why Hobby Lobby's in business. But, all right. Now, since I don't have any of these on here, I might as well start, there we go, Let's start on this side. Start up here and work our way down. There we 
go. Does anybody know how to like work a glue glue gun? You know what I'm saying? Like, cause clearly the string that comes off of it. Like, how do you work? Air quotes. How do you work the glue gun? You see, there they are. I need to twirl it. That's one way I found that works. It's twirling. I know that everybody's got a different method. See, sometimes I'll do that. All right, and then I think I want to lay that down just so it looks a little less silly for me. Personal taste. Whew, hot. All right, there we go. Make that overlap. I'm just going to let this stick wherever it wants to be. I ain't got time. I ain't got time for that. All right. Don't worry about the glue. I said that. I said that. Don't worry about the glue. All right. Except when it's in your way. Okay, here's this one. Let's lap that down there. Fold that over. Ugh, just made a mess. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, don't stress it. Don't stress it. Get rid of you. You're in my way. Here we go. Here we go. There we go, moss. Okay. It's coming along. Slowly but surely. More surely than slowly. See, it's a little messy with the moss. That's why you gotta just prepare yourself with something. And if you don't like messy, don't play with moss because it's it is it just is messy. And I just touched all that glue. Where did all my? I cut some green. I cut it, and then you gotta have a place to get rid of this stuff. Okay, now, <sighs> more moss. All right, I got scraps of moss, but let's cut trying to overthink it, not trying to work too fast or too slow with it. I feel like this side should go underneath because it's just weird. All right, let's get you in there. And then we can fold it over. It's like a big old tongue. Blah, blah, blah. off a piece. I'm going to cut a piece so I can fold this easier. Might lay down. Oh, there it goes. See, it might lay down better for me. A little bit. Sure did. Sure enough did. Alright. Now, I didn't use these. These are left over from another project. So let's See, literally everything is everywhere. It's just, it's all over. It is what it is. Okay. I don't want this. The honky piece right here. It's a lot of, a lot of big old piece right there. We'll get rid of that big honky piece. You're too big. Why do we say honking? Like a horn. Honk it a honk? I don't really know. Okay. Oh, look at that. That would be lovely. But then again, it conquers more territory. What am I doing? 
Let's see. Yes, it's gonna do that. It's gonna conquer a little territory. Now, granted, if I already had these separated, I could layer it and make it look, we'll say prettier. Let's be honest, it would look prettier if I had more room to layer it, but I don't, that's okay. So again, you know it's gonna work because it's sat, it's sitting. So it's not in the way of anything. And then you can take a spot of glue and glue that down. Oh, we are now on on to three. All right, third glue stick. Doing it. All right, let's glue this down. Whew, that's a big dollop. Big dollop of daisy right there. All right, turn it on its side. Get it where you want it. You show this project to your boss. All right, I got a little piece here. I'm gonna stick it right here. Tuck that in. Oh, mercy, it's coming off. It's coming off and onto me. Get down, get down. It's all these strays coming at me. Try to stick a little bit right there. Try to stick some, stick some fur. Oh, come on, oh, it's sticking to me. It's sticking to me. Not what I want, not what I want. Not what I want. All right, we're probably gonna cover that in a second. It's a fighting battle. I seem to be losing it. All right. Pros and cons sometimes when you got the... All right, since I'm here, I ended up here. I'm just gonna go ahead and work with that. Since I was right there, just stick it down. There's my third piece. All right. See, sometimes you gotta swirl. So I swirl, that's a swirl. So that swirl didn't work too well. So when I pull up the glue gun, I swirl it. Swirl it! But all right, all right, so as we go along, thank you for choosing the House of Ginger. And again, this is Fairy Moss, good times with our shoe. Fall treat, if you like a pretty shoe. If you have an old shoe, decorate it up. Okay, good stuff. Now, oof. Something's giving me an itch. All right, let's see. This I liked because it had a soft look. I think that's why we like the look of cotton because it has that soft, I'm sticking those there so I don't lose them. It has that softness, softness to it that we like, that we enjoy. We're tactile some people are ooh, get that out of the way are more tactile than others all right so I'm just gonna fold that over and work work that to my advantage I just like this bobble so I'm gonna keep showing the bobble Jeez, some bitch in me all right and All right, here's a big one. Let's take this leaf. Make it happen. Then there's the smoosh. So there's always the smoosh. So you got the smoosh, you got the swirl. How do you do it? Let me know, please, because I am always 
dealing with it one way or the other. So swirl, smoosh, smoosh and swipe, what are you going to call that? All right, this is looking nice. So we got this side. Obviously there are some holes so I can get back to scrap and moss here. Look at that, scrap and moss. Let's just take our, oh, I don't have any backing on it. Duh. I just, whew, barely missed my fingernail on that one. Swirled it, swirled it. All right, grab it, grab it, grab it. I'm thinking maybe I can sprinkle, it's like crumbs. Gather up your crumbs and sprinkle, sprinkle the crumbs. Try not to let it collect on you. Oh, I swear there's something, something, something got me. All right, and then I think I'm gonna give this an underscore here. And just I'm going out of going out of left field here going way out of left field just throwing it down I really did not have a plan for this shoe and that's okay because sometimes overthinking and crafting can be good or bad so you know what you're doing for one good don't know what you're doing sometimes bad Swirl it. Oh, all right. I'll get rid of that mouse later. Burning my fingertip. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right. Got another little, and it's attached. I got some hot piece of glue right there. Just wanna. Oh, I'm stuck on you. You're stuck on me. All right, we're gonna stick it down because I just, I don't like it batting in the wind. It's not my thing. Too free. You're too free. All right. How are we looking? Oh, get down, get down, get down. Okay. Those didn't look bad just hanging out there. All right, clear the air, Let's shove it over here on my desk. All right, now, what do we got going on here? All right, we got a hole here, hole here. All right, let's fix a little bit of glue. Or did we want the softer stuff? Oh, question mark, question mark. All right, last minute decision. Look at that. I was cutting the greens. Now I went with the went with the softer side. Gluing myself. Gluing myself. All right. Now clearly this looks different than this one. Definitely. And by way of the back different. You see that line's not perfect, but that's okay. It's not the end of the world. If you want to fix it, fix it. All right. I know all the sticking to yourself is going to be annoying as crap, but that's life. All right. We're going on a minute 29. I know time is of the essence. Essentially we have, Oh, got a hole right here. Gonna patch that up. Swirled it. All right, we got some ready studies because we had already cut. Good to go. Hide it up, hide it up. Get up there. Got another patch. Thank you for choosing the House of Ginger. 
final project pictures will be posted on thehouseofginger.com. This has been the Fairy Moss Shoe Project. I think they're cute. They're going on a display shelf. So they're for my enjoyment. Hope you enjoyed. Oh, oof, oof. Get down, get down. Good times. Look at that. So 30 minute a shoe. Definitely three glue sticks a piece. Um, moss. Otherwise, Dollar Tree, Shoe Salvation Army, Hobby Lobby Pick, Hobby Lobby Pick, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, Hobby Lobby Moss. So, there you go. Thanks for choosing the House of Ginger. And check out the, web the website, thehouseofginger.com, for more creative ideas as we go along. Have a great day.